In this tutorial, we will do a simple linear stress analysis using Autodesk Inventor Simulation. And we will learn how to interpret result and we will see either this model is safe or not. So let's do this simple exercise in Autodesk Inventor. So first we have to create a model. Activate new and from here I am going to select go to metric standard millimeter create now first i am going to create our model so drop down the origin and choose any origin if you click on home button and you can activate 3d space so i am going to say xy plane if you click xy plane you will see one symbol here create sketch so click and activate now i am going to activate line tool and i am going to draw something like this and connect press escape key or right click ok now make this constraint fully constrained first I am going to choose here activate horizontal constraint now I am going to select this line ok this already there ok this already there now activate this vertical line and select this line. Now select this coincident constraint and select this point and this point. Okay. Fine. Now select this midpoint. See this blue green line is the midpoint of this. Select this point and origin point. And here it fixes. Now right click. Okay. Activate dimension. I am going to define full length 80 ok ok again let's say this one 15 ok again 15 fine now distance between these two 7 now right click okay now still we need to define few more important constraint let's say equal I am going to define these two length equal but here we need to define equal select this one and this one both should be equal right click okay if you see right bottom fully constrained symbol so simply finish sketch and activate extrude feature now here input geometry the profile this is close profile already activated now this is the start condition so this is going to start from x y plane it is already selected now behavior you have to change the direction see but i am going to select this middle one symmetric and this is going to be 20 okay name you can whatever name you can give taper we don't need say okay okay now let's activate here is stress analysis now this is stress analysis tab open now first we have to create a study activate study now here three types of study static analysis mold analysis model analysis and shape generator so i am going to keep normal even though you can name this analysis this is single points keep everything as it is say okay now we entered in analysis tab now first we have to define the material for this model so here activate and assign now material any material you can define let's say aluminium 601 right click on aluminium assign to selection cancel now see material applied here factor of safety everything you will see here simply say ok now now it's time to apply force but before going to apply force we have to fix few important thing now directly activate orbit free orbit and rotate your model now right click ok and exit simply here find fixed now location i am going to select this face and this face these two faces going to fix if we apply any pressure on the body anywhere it is not going to move simply apply cancel home next apply force 
okay i am going to apply location let's say this face and here let's say 100 newton these are the scale everything keep as it is even though you can change the color of this uh, but i am going to keep same apply cancel okay now even you can apply mesh okay fine okay let's go to simulate and run look if you don't want mesh simply uncheck check now if you see in left side we have stress analysis then displacement factor of safety and strain so all the analysis are here and you will see one chart this blue color shows minimum and orange or red color shows maximum stress if i okay let's uh, there is one probe if you want to find out analysis at any point simply click probe and let's say i'm going to select this po portion this one and see you will observe here stress analysis press and hold shift key and press middle mouse and move your mouse and see you can rotate the model now look at this point stress analysis is maximum so if i am going to click on this point you will see 1.3 this is near to maximum okay now finish even though if you want to let's say animate show original speed you can keep fast or normal play if i am going to keep front see okay right click on any probe and simply delete all probe that's it now double click on displacement and you will see maximum displacement at center but in chart you will observe minimum displacement zero millimeter you will see this unit in millimeter and maximum 0 0.00106 this is safe we don't need to define any factor of safety for this if you see this is totally safe zone if you want to check probe and let's check the maximum displacement you will see 0 0.03 if if you see somewhere uh, here this is very small even at center this is very small displacement right click finish animate let's say fastest look you will observe the displacement i hope you like this video don't forget to share and like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solidworks and autodesk inventor this is a simple tutorial how to set up simulation in autodesk inventor thanks for watching